Cross Games with the Musician Network. We're in Clifton, New Jersey. Let's go on ahead on into Tech 21 and see what we can find out. President and CEO of Tech 21. Andrew, how are you doing this morning? Hey, how are you? Very good. We very much appreciate having a chance to meet with you today. And uh, Andrew's going to actually give us a tour of the Tech 21 factory. So, Andrew, I'll let you take it away. We'll uh, let you go ahead and uh, show us a little bit about your facility here. Okay. This is the uh, production area. So this is this is essentially where Tech 21 happens. Well, basically, yes. Um, we are very proud that we actually build this product here. Absolutely. In America. We are 10, 10 miles from Manhattan. We used to be in Manhattan for the first 10 years of uh, our existence. And obviously, you can see we outgrew it. You know, yes, to absolutely. pay for a facility like this in Manhattan, I think the only company can do that is Merrill Lynch. Yeah, correct. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Nevertheless, you can see this one is base drivers okay. uh, being prepared for production putting the jacks first and then we put in the PC boards then we test it. Um, a lot of the subcomponents are also made locally like uh, we have a metal factory not okay. far from here 10 minutes away okay. that they do a lot of metal work, a paint factory that is 10 minutes away that they do painting and cell screening. Of course we have to buy some parts from uh, China as yes, everybody sure. else do. Nobody sure. makes electronic parts anymore like potentiometers. That's, that's There's the only no source. Correct. So, you know, where, where we have to go to China, we do. Yes. But whatever we can do here, and has has to do with quality, yes. we keep it here. Okay. And the most important, obviously, is the uh, uh, assembly and testing. Correct. And the testing, I'm going to show you that part. We have a very highly skilled musician who actually tests all the products. Wonderful. You know? uh, so let's move on. Okay. Uh, here's another product that's getting ready for production. That's our programmable base driver. Fantastic. Okay. And this is a pedal, a floor pedal base product. Yes. Correct. Yes, with three presets okay. that it can we can recall uh, our presets. Okay. This is an assembly area. That's where we assemble um, the amplifiers. For example, here's a 10, trademark 10, okay. actually 30. Okay. Now, now this upgraded to 30, we have a 10 inch speaker in it. And that's where they put in the chassis, final assembly. You know, Tom is our tester. He, he does, he's a right. guitar player. Fantastic. And then Tommy, good works. to see you. He, we lock him into that room. And, and, and he stays out. there, I understand. So we'll so follow him. Into, at least, uh, we'll follow him into his lair. Yeah. He gets air conditioning. And the, but this room gets quite loud, is that right? Actually, he's supposed to play a lot of them, like not, not that loud, because sometimes like a res, resonant uh, problem. At a, low, at a lower volume. Exactly. And that's the most of the problems we have, like a cabinet is, is, has a loose screw or something, and I he see. plays through, and he finds the problem and fixes it. Or if it's beyond repair, then, you know, like kicks it back to them to, to, to you know, replace the cabinet or do something about it. Or as I said, sometimes the speaker is faulty. Yes. There could be a problem with the speaker. Okay. And that's why we really want to have somebody who has a skilled ear to find those things, because okay. maybe an average person wouldn't hear that. It's like, oh, I hear, I hear the guitar coming through, and that's good enough. Yes, it's correct. not for us. Okay. Not for us, yeah. <laughs> 